welcome to today's Talk of the Town. I'm Sandy Benson. Low Country Alliance for Healthy Youth is a community coalition to bring together all sectors of the Bluffton and Hilton Head area while working on both local and national effort to increase awareness about the myths, risks, and consequences of teen alcohol and drug use abuse. Here to tell us more, advocates Roberta Foss and Francine Tobin. Welcome, ladies, to the Thank show. Thank you for having us. Thank you. So tell us a little bit about Low Country Alliance for Healthy Youth, R Roberta. Low Country Alliance for Healthy Youth is a group that was formed back in February of 2012 um, in an effort to create and bring together all sectors of our community to help promote some positive choices and address the risk-related behaviors of our teens. So <clears throat> the, uh, the actual alliance is here locally, but uh, there is, from what I understand, a town hall meeting that's working more or less. You're, I, I think you're working in conjunction with a national um, association to provide a town hall meeting we for the are. same reason. And that is the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration. They've recognized that week of May 19th as a teen prevention week and are promoting town halls across our nation, bringing together local experts to help address teen abuse and substance use. And they're allowing you grants as well, from what I understand, they right? They are, yes. They've afforded us a small grant to help us promote and market the town hall meeting. So, Francine, let's talk a little bit about the town hall meeting, where, when, and what exactly you're trying to accomplish. Well, the meeting's May 19th, which is Monday, uh, at Hilton Head Island High School and the Seahawk Cultural Center, um, which is the former VPAC. We are trying to, we are planning a, a panel of experts who will each, three different experts will speak for th about 15 minutes each. One will be a drug law enforcement expert who's going to talk about an emerging teen issue, which is prescription drug use. Mm. Um, then we are going to have a pediatrician. He's an, a recognized pediatrician. He's spoken on this topic around the country. Um, he's going to speak about the health consequences of teen drug use and teen alcohol use. And then we're going to have a local attorney who's going to speak about the legal consequences to teens who use drugs and alcohol and the civil and legal consequences to parents or other adults who might serve or host teen drugs or alcohol use. And you are also hoping, I'm thinking, for teens to be uh, part of this, this, this form. This is to educate teens and adults, uh, raise the awareness of this issue in our local community, and to have an open discussion. We're going to have teens participate in the meeting, uh, in the town hall meeting. We're going to open the meeting up to the to our community so that we can basically mobilize the community on this effort and whatever sector of the community might, you might be in, whether you're an educator, you're a coach, you're a, a le youth group leader, you're a, a town official or a local, um, you know, locally a leader in your town, or we have people who are in the food and beverage business right. who are affected by this. Right. Um, so we are trying to raise the awareness and we would like adults and teens to be part of the meeting. And uh, my thought is this is not just a teen, I mean it's it's significant you know among that age group, but this is not just a teen problem. So there are a lot of people that would it would behoove them to be at this and, and be educated and more aware and I think the consequences is, is a big part of this. It is. Um, you know this started, our group started when uh, there was a perceived increase in teen drug and alcohol use by our local educators and also when there were some very serious car accidents that involved teen drinking or drug use mm -hmm. and so when we read that in the paper and we think we feel bad about it well we're trying to mobilize and do something about it we're trying to educate and um, raise awareness and and have a discussion with right. our community and <clears throat> I would assume that part of this town hall meeting is not just somebody speaking out and giving facts, but more of a Q&A where then people are able to recognize um, where they can go, where, you know, different, exactly. I guess, different organizations that are available for what maybe their area. That's correct. You might, be, you might know of a teen or have a teen or be the grandparent of a teen who you feel is engaging in risky behaviors or may or is on the cusp and we're trying to offer resources to you. We want to show you what's in our community that could help. And quickly, the date and the time. May 19th at 6 to 8 p.m. at Hilton Head High School.
Thank you so much Thank for you. joining us. Thank Good information. You for Absolutely. Me, Sandy. And we will be right back with Talk of the Town.